After a while, we started covering Trump um, in a way that, that, like a lot of legacy news, news organizations, that we were trying to damage his presidency, to, to even if find anything we could to harm him. And I think what we latched on to was Russia collusion. Yuri Berliner, a long-serving senior editor at NPR, resigned just days after being suspended for publicly criticizing the network's perceived liberal bias in an op-ed. In a social media post Wednesday, Berliner shared his resignation letter where he commended NPR as a valuable institution, but criticized its current leadership for exacerbating issues he raised in a recent op-ed. His critique, which claimed NPR catered exclusively to a narrow liberal perspective, sparked significant internal controversy and led to his suspension last week for violating policies regarding external publications. The fallout from Berliner's op-ed has not only reignited debates within NPR about its editorial direction, but also drew attention from conservative critics, including those highlighting progressive-oriented social media posts by NPR's CEO Catherine Marr before taking the reins at the network. While NPR's bias arguments are back in the headlines, Senator Marsha Blackburn of Tennessee is also once again pursuing legislative measures to cut federal funding to NPR, arguing that the publicly funded broadcaster should not exhibit partisan bias. Blackburn previously aimed to reduce funding for the Corporation for Public Broadcasting by $50 million during her tenure as a House representative in 2011.